Island. Family dogs. Real family Kyle Bush dogs. Yeah. This is it. Episode four. Welcome to the show. I'm Pern. I'm Boris. And uh, yeah. Okay, let's start over. I didn't like that. Okay. All of our drivers All will three. be right here on the show today, as well as potentially some exciting other guests that mm -hmm. you will not want to miss. We got a comment from one particular fan, uh, Wayne Butler, who says, can't you guys what, get whoa, whoa. It's in all caps, so you have to yell. It's all caps. <laughs> oh, it is? Does that mean yell? The big okay. evil caps. Can't you guys get some cool people to host this? Look at these two. <laughs> they look like the guys that work for Geek Squad at Best Buy. That hurts. What? It hurts. If my calculations are correct, carry the one. I believe it will take 1.21 gigawatts to oh. harness the power in that computer. Yes. To actually mm. make this show humorous. Ha! Huh. Precisely. What? This is the body of an Adonis. Let, that... me, let me have you know. <laughs> okay, I don't even know what that means. Hey everybody, we're back in Kyle and I's motorhome, and I got Boris here because Boris lost quite the bet. If Kyle ever won Talladega, Boris said I could straighten this mop. So that's what we're back here to do today. Yes, and we're fresh off his incredible win where he spins, wrecks, hits everything in sight, and comes back and wins. Why would I ever bet against Kyle Busch? <laughs> we're hoping that Kyle gets back from media in time to see what his hair turns into. I think it's going to look like something like this. <laughs> Is that, that's my guess. Probably. <laughs> Shall we go to the hot seat? Let's go. All right. All right, so poor Boris over here. He's gonna get straightened, maybe curled under, flipped up. We've got an in-styler here. It's a little bit different than your normal straightener. Instead of just pulling it straight, it rotates. Oh, so that sounds horrible. does a lot of stuff. Boris got a lot of hair in here. Yeah. Are the ladies gonna like this? <gasps> Boris, you got gray. Oh gosh. <laughs> no, seriously, film this. We got a big chunk of gray right here. Is everybody seeing that? Oh. Is everybody seeing that? That's I'm only great. 25. It's all the tweeting. Boy. Oh. <laughs> it's all good, Boris. Just keep your head. Oh my god. Oh. 10 I'm losing a lot of respect for you right now. Your hair is cooking. I can smell it. It's like frying it up. <laughs> All right, so here we are in Kyle Busch's motorhome with the fine Samantha Bush and Our web guy Boris. Web guy Boris, what do you feel about your new do? Uh, it's styling, not exactly what I expected. What do you think of it? It's got a little David Rudiman-ish to it, I think. <laughs> uh, maybe that's just your face. I'm not sure. The hair, no, no, the, the hair. Corn rolls, really? Yeah, yeah, I, you know. I go out, I want to be styling. Why Why did you get me cornrows? What do you... Well, you know, I thought I'd help with the ladies. I thought they'd appreciate, you know. Yeah. There's bobby pins in your hair, in case you haven't noticed. I've never had metal in my hair. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about this. I don't know. He lost the bet. We said that you couldn't win Tal... He said you couldn't win Talladega. I, of course, stuck up for you, and... Oh, well, good. Very good. That was the end of it. Yeah. So I had to win today in order to get this happen? Mm -hmm. So good job, babe. Yeah, I was looking good for a while. Yeah. I mean, Boris, are you kidding me? How could you bet I against Kyle? I don't know. I'm worse of a person for having witnessed that. No. That was uh, frightening is uh, the only word I can think of. How in the world did you get it back? Humidity and time and skill, my friend. <sighs> okay, today's newspaper shows the USA Today All-American High School basketball players. And ironically, they were here in this very building just last Thursday. All of them. 
All of them. Heads they, touching the ceiling. They were some big guys, good guys. The best 20 uh, college recruits came for the Jordan brand classic that was played right here in Charlotte. Then he handled them and gave them a tour of the shop. He did? He had them try their hand at a pit stop and didn't go so well. No. Yeah, don't take our word for it. Yeah. You, you got to watch this. Check it out. Hold on, hold on. When do I have to Get buckets, Mike. Get it, Mike. Go at it. Go whenever I'm ready. Yeah. When you're ready? Yeah. All right, man. Tell me on the mark. Get set. Go. Mark. Uh, get set. Go. <laughs> Show him how to show him how to put the glass down there. Want those? Yeah. All right. Yeah. Show him how. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it felt good. Tire weighs about 75 to 80 pounds, the wheel. Show them out. I don't think I can do it. Oh. <laughs> See, I don't have my... I want you to put Show on him the, the grip. There you go. He's got it. Let's throw it on there. Just go, go. Pretty cool right here. So all the top 20 high school basketball players in the country just signed a hood for for Denny, so uh, I don't want to see this on eBay anytime soon, but that's pretty cool right there. This will definitely, um, this will be one of my prized uh, possessions right here. Who knows how many future NBA Hall of Famers are probably on this hood right here. Pretty sweet. You guys, great guys. It was good to have them, the coaches, the trainers, uh, the Jordan guys. It was a lot of fun. Yep. And if you liked what you saw, rate, comment, and subscribe. Thumbs up. To our show, to our channel on YouTube, comment. please. Subscribe. And feel free, if you've got criticism, like our friend Wayne, we're thick-skinned. Yes. We can take it. Yeah, send us, some, send us some messages. I read them all personally. Preferably good ones. Yeah. But we'll take a bad one. Cheerleading. You do it like this.